Welcome to Knicks.com. I'm Jonah Bello here with the number eight overall pick for the New York Knicks. And before we get to anything, Frank, we need the pronunciation on your name. You knew it was coming, right? So let's do it right now for all the Knicks fans out there and these media members here. Let's hear the pronunciation. Okay, my name, so my name is Frank Nilikina. Nilikina. The T is silent. T is silent right there. So good. Now that we got that covered, you know, what has the process been like for you? I mean, you've been in and out of the States and now in New York a couple days. What's your reaction to this uh, hoop loss surrounding you and this pick? Uh, definitely crazy. Crazy couple of weeks. Last weeks were crazy. I was trying to get a championship uh, with my team. Still trying. Definitely tomorrow is a big game for us. And uh, yeah, I stepped uh, into New York uh, like two days ago. Uh, it was a lot of emotions. And now just to, to hear my name uh, playing for New York, just great, great. Yeah, when you step on that stage and shake Adam Silver's hands and realize you're in the NBA now with the New York Knicks, what is that feeling like? It was just wow to, to walk in on the stage, to, to see everybody, to hear my name. Uh, wow, just like uh, 14, 14 years, like dream, and actually come true, so wow. You're a young guy playing in professional basketball the past couple years. What's been the reaction like with your buddies playing overseas and back at home? What have they said to you uh, during this process? Um, they told me actually to not be worried about the process, that I'll be fine. They know I'm a, like a, I work hard. Uh, I'm, they, they all tell me I'm a humble kid, and they all tell me they don't worry about where I will be. I will be fine. Uh, they give me a lot of advices, and they all been great to me. Some of them been, been into the NBA. So that's just been great to, to, to play with them and to play against them. All right, now uh, looking at your game tape, I've been watching in the past couple of weeks knowing that you could be a, a pick for the New York Knicks. But for fans out there who haven't seen your game yet, describe what kind of player you are. Uh, definitely a good defender, a good defender that is willing to play defense and then no offense. Um, I know that I, I'm a team player. I'm just trying to get the win. It's, I think for me it's, it's the most important thing, uh, trying to make, make my teammates be better. Uh, and then I can shoot the ball, pass it, and play in pick and roll. I know I have a lot of work to make um, my own play uh, uh, in the NBA. It's going to be tough for, for sure, but uh, definitely I'm uh, willing to work and I will trust the process and try and be the best player I can be. Did you ever think about going to college here in the States or was it always going to be uh, the opportunity to play overseas and play in France? Uh, actually. All went great when I was back in France. Uh, the process was, was all great. So actually, I didn't need to, to, to go to college. Even if college is just a great experience. All my teammates back in France who went, who've been to college told me um, like uh, just the better experience of their life. But uh, to me, like it has been great. It has been a great way to, to, to be here, actually. So no regrets. What advantage do you have? You know, I talked to Chris Stapsford-Zingas two years ago about this, that he's been playing against grown men, playing professional basketball already, and the fact that that helped him really in his rookie season get right into the NBA against, you know, difficult competition. How will that help your game now for your rookie season? Like, I think you're mentally more prepared. Not, I don't know if you're prepared, like, for the NBA, but you're more prepared to face challenges, uh, to face uh, contact, uh, to play against... Uh, 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 stronger men than you, so I think in, even even uh, out of the out of the court, uh, to know how to take care of your body, to know just how to be as a man, as a professional uh, basketball player, uh, is just great to 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 live it, and uh, I think it will help me a lot. All right, this league is loaded with point guards coming in as a point guard. Any guys that you see out there that you're going to be excited from day one to go up against? Uh, I mean, all of the best point guards, all the point guards, uh, I think I'm a com competitor and uh, I'll definitely be excited to play against all of them and uh, I just can't wait. Growing up, any favorite players that stand out that you used to watch uh, in the NBA? Uh, favorite player, not one sp uh, in particular, but uh, I just liked it to, to watch all of them, uh, to see what I can bring from them to my game and from that to build my own game. So, like I said, I, I'm just excited to to work and to be ready to go out there and compete against all of them. All right, off the court, what are you getting into when you're not playing basketball? Uh, music, movies, what are your interests there? Uh, hearing a lot of music, listening to a lot of music, movies, yeah, like I said, and video games. Okay, what's your favorite video game? Uh, FIFA. 
definitely. Okay, we're going to fit in right with the Knicks because they love playing FIFA. <laughs> so that's a great thing. Just tell, tell them I'm going to be ready. Oh, okay. <laughs> now we got fighting words out of them. And uh, any particular artists, uh, music-wise, that you like to listen to? Uh, Drake, Drake Future, and Meek Mill. Uh, definitely. I've been watching uh, them uh, in New York last year. Yep. Uh, so definitely they, 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 they're my favorite uh, artist. Okay, now last question. Uh, you've been in New York a couple days now. What's one thing that once you get to live here, be in the city, playing with this team, what's one thing that you want to do and, and see it here in New York? The gym. Man, perfect answer for me. <laughs> thank you. Frank, thank you so much. We got the pronunciation. Frank Nilakina got that right. And uh, we are looking forward to the season. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, guys. There he is, the number eight overall pick right here on NewYorkKnicks.com.